Today I wanted to show you a few tips on yeah. Oui. Oui. <laughs> on how to increase your milk flow. Um, some moms think that their milk is not enough and they need to increase their, their flow. And first of all, I would say make sure that your milk is not enough or that your flow is not enough because that is only a very, very small percent of women don't have enough milk flow. So first of all, make sure that your milk flow is actually low because it might not be. So first of all, um, I would suggest that uh, you make sure that your baby is nursing correctly, that he has a good latch because the the latch is a very important part of breastfeeding. If you don't have a good latch, then your baby might not be emptying your breast as, uh, as he should. So I made a video about a good latch. If you want to check it out, I will put it in the link below. Yeah. And another tip that I could give you is to nurse frequently. Uh, the difference between breastfeeding and bottle feeding is that bottle feeding, you should feed him every three hours, I think. Uh, when it comes to breastfeeding, you should feed him on demand. You should feed your baby as much as he wants. Um, another tip that I can give you. Let the baby finish the first side and before you go to the other side. So offer both sides. Another tip that I can give you is to not use pacifiers or other bottles. And that is because all the needs of the baby when it comes to feeding, they should be at the breast. And that would also increase the chances of having a higher milk production. Another tip that I can give you is, as the mama, you should be in good health. That means that you should rest frequently. I know it's not easy when you have a newborn or when you have a baby in general, but try to get as much sleep as you can. Try to eat well and eat consistently and drink. You don't have to drink too much. It's not true that if you drink more, you're going to have a higher milk supply. That's not true. Drink when you're thirsty and drink enough so your, your urine has a clear color. That means that you're not dehydrating, but you don't need to overdrink. Okay. Also, I would suggest if you want to increase the milk that is going to your baby when you nurse, uh, try the compression technique. And I actually, yeah. And I actually showed that technique in, the, in another video. And I will also put the link below. Yeah, yeah. So, I think those are all the tips that I wanted to give you. Oh, I forgot to tell you, if you can also consider pumping if you want to increase your milk flow. That's also a good way of, in, of uh, increasing your milk flow. So go ahead and pump maybe um, a few times a day to increase your milk flow. Yeah, yeah. But anyway, if you follow all these tips, there really should be no way, unless you have a medical condition, that your milk is not enough. Um, so, yeah. Um, there are no such things as foods that make your, that increase your milk flow. Like, I've heard about beer, I've heard about other stuff. I don't think it's true. I think these are the best guidelines I could give you in order to improve your milk flow. But uh, but there's nef definitely no food that I know that can increase your milk flow. At least no ordinary food, no day-to-day -day food, especially not alcohol. So anyway, um, have um, a happy breastfeeding and I will see you in my next video. Bye. Bye.